Hello, boys and girls, and welcome back to The Tilt, a fiasco podcast. Today, we'll be listening to Act 2 of the business-themed playset that we started on Wednesday. We'd like to once again thank Dr. Linden on iTunes for leaving us a five-star review and recommending the name Linden Heathenrod for one of the characters. If you'd like to have your character name used in a future episode, head over to iTunes, leave us a five-star review, and put the name of the character you'd like us to use in the body of the review. As I said, this is Act 2, and if you haven't already listened to Act 1, you might want to go back and do that, just so you'll know who all the characters are and where we are in the story. And now, without any further ado, lean forward, tense up, and get ready for Act 2 of Linden's Business. Let's play Fiasco. All right. Our tilt elements this week are tragedy, death after an unpleasant struggle, and paranoia, a stranger arrives to settle a score. Here's the thing. Jareth is uh, working feverishly in his office on the ABCA Section 100 paperwork. Um, he's going to find... Well, no. He's just working on it. He's going to turn on the radio. That's what's going to happen. All right. So great. And the scene ends good for him. Um, all right. So I'm just... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn on the radio... KVCA, coming to you with a, a hot deal on some tickets. Just name this song. Oh, story. Okay, I'm just working on this paperwork now. Wait, I know this. I'm, I'm a true juggalo. I need to... Wait. I know this song. I'm going to call right now. Boop, 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 boop. KGCA, you're caller four. Go ahead. Uh, oh, my God. I can't believe I made it through. Yeah, can you name that song? You're long, the right caller. Long time listener, first time caller. <laughs> um. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You've reached the drive time zoo crew with <laughs> Fart and the Stupid. <laughs> Don't. Is it Boogie Woogie <laughs> Woo by Insane Clown Posse? You got yeah, it, yeah, buddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yay! Yeah. What, got it, buddy. What, what tickets did I win? Is it That's to the your, gathering? It's your choice, buddy. You got I two want, pairs of tickets to wear whatever you want. I want four I want four pairs of one ticket to the gathering, <laughs> please. You got it, buddy. Hang on the line. We'll get your details from Great. you. Great. I'm going to work on this paperwork while you do. I'm at the office right now. All right. Hang on right there. And okay, uh, let, me get your name. let me get your name for the air. My name is Jareth Cute Story. That sounds gay. 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 That sounds gay. Okay. All right. We're just, we're just going to, Jareth, we're going to go with Jareth C on the air. Uh, go ahead and say, uh, this station rocks my balls off. Go ahead and say that for us. My balls. Hey, this is Jareth C. And this station rocks my balls off. Ba -ball, ba -ball, ba -ball. All right, fantastic, Jareth. Hang on the line. Susan will get you Jareth, information. It's with a soft G. Yeah, hang, hang on. Hang on for me. All right, great. I'm going to work on this paperwork. All right. Congratulations oh, to Collar right. for Jareth C. He hey. won four tickets of his choice to wherever he wants to go, and he chose the gathering. The so yeah. here he goes. Yeah. All right. Right here on KLSMZs. KGCA? The fart. <laughs> <laughs> I love the fart. It's my favorite radio station. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna hang up the phone now. So classy. <laughs> keep it keep it real, Zoo Crew. <laughs> my balls are always swinging. Ball, for you. Ball, 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 ball. Balls. All right, great. Balls. Okay, I'm swinging. Work, I'm gonna work on this paperwork. It's made of cardboard, this paperwork. <laughs> <gasps> Wait a second. I see some inaccuracies on this. Mr. Heathenrod has been lying to everyone. Somebody say Heathenrod? That's a little gay, I think. Rod. 
Did somebody say Rod? I need to. I need to tell somebody about this. If 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 the, he's been he's been doing a, a <laughs> slew of non-compliant things for ABCA Section One Hundred. <sighs> What's up, Jareth? Hey, hey, Todd Glass. How are you? <laughs> Oh, wait, you're Kyle. <laughs> Kyle, you look like the guy in, in accounting, and you sound like him, too. His name is Todd Glass. <laughs> you guys talking about me? Todd, go away. I'm working on something. Okay. You didn't show up in the dance studio, so I came up to see like what you're doing. Kyle, I, I, have, I am in a whirlwind of emotions right now. It has been up and down for me right now. Oh, yeah? How I, come? Well... well I'm going to tell you the bad news first. Your father is non-compliant for ABCA <laughs> Section 100. Okay. <laughs> the great news is I got four single pairs of tickets. The fire alarm. There's a fire alarm going off right now. They must be doing maintenance. Yeah, I finally found one to pull. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Kyle, you're so funny. Yeah, you're a, you're a real James Dean style rebel. Yeah. Um, so I got four single pairs of tickets to the gathering. No way. Four single pairs of tickets. That's awesome. Yeah, so do you want to be like my 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 down ass juggalo brother for life? Yeah. Do you want to you want to fago shower each other until we die? <laughs> yeah. Sick. We're going to do so much ayahuasca. It's going to be great. Guess what though? I got my dad's car. It's for reals? Yeah. Well, fuck this job. Fucking jag, dude. All right. Well, I'm going to just um I'm going to make sure that things get comp- well, I don't even care about compliance. I'm just going to write on a sticky note to pretty vanilla right now. To say, hey, check out things about Heathen Rod for the compliance. It, uh, who cares? She's got huge tits. She can figure it out. Yeah, she does have killer tits. All right, so I'm going to just leave this open. I'm going to circle this part. And do you want to just hit the road? Yeah. Oh, well, I got to go talk to Greg first, but it, yeah. All right, sick. I'm going to go I'm gonna go warm up your dad's car. Wait, you know what? I'm going to get all the Fago. Yeah, that load we, up the trunk, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna get the Fago. I'm gonna get some poppers, and um, and I gotta go get my fucking Somebody face on. Poppers over there. It's a little gay. I think. Sounds a little gay. It's a little gay. Yeah, it's a little gay. Dude. I, okay. Well, I just need to go get my face straight. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that does not sound gay at all. Nope. All right. Nope. So I'm gonna do that right now, it's a Kyle. Hetero. He checks it's out. A he checks out. Kyle, I'm gonna do that. And um, if you happen to run into little pretty tits, like go ahead and let her know what the deal is. Sure. All right, sick bro. There we go. Pretty's gonna resolve. He runs into Kyle. She. 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 She was really gay, dude. What a twist. <laughs> <laughs> she runs into Kyle, and this is gonna end well for her. I hope your mama is coming. Oh, hey there. <laughs> you know. Oh, uh, hey, pretty. Your name's pretty, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Pretty vanilla. Pretty vanilla. That's me. What? I haven't seen you around the office before. Who? No. Who? Um, Linda and Heather Dick is my <laughs> stepdad. Oh. <laughs> The big boss. That's your stepdad. He's yeah. Really, he's not yeah. that big, really. Yeah, it's kind of stupid. It's a little gay too. With hey, it. a little gay. Uh, killer tits though. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Yeah. You know, th- I saw him uh, and I was in Lyndon's office and they were on a screen and there. It was pretty killer. They were on a screen. What screen? What screen? I don't know, what? some screen in his office. Anyway. Okay. Oh, you know that guy. Um. Jareth or whatever. Yeah, Mr. Cute Story. Yeah, I don't like that name, but yeah. Okay, okay. Uh, I was just talking to him, and like he said, if I saw your tits, I mean, if I saw you, <laughs> I was supposed <laughs> to tell you oh. that like my stepdad is a dick, and he was doing something wrong about complying with ABBA, um, like uh, ABCA. Oh yeah, that's what it was. Oh my goodness. And I guess he was like he was. 
he was messing with the papers or something for the section or something or complying with i don't i wasn't really listening because it just sounded like business bullshit plus he gave he told me he got tickets to like the gathering you know what the gathering is <laughs> cute story has tickets for the gathering for the, for the insane clown posse yeah we're totally going like in like 25 minutes you want to go i do i really want to but that would be killer if you brought your tits and we went. <laughs> uh, you know I want to bring my tits with me. I, I think I need to take care of this, this ABCA thing though. Jareth is counting on me, and if if it's up, if something's wrong with your dad, then this goes all the way to the top. This sounds yeah, big. it probably does. I don't. It's, it sounds businessy to me, so I didn't get it really. But uh, like so, like meet us in the parking garage. In like twenty five minutes or whatever, okay, and we're leave, we're going to the gathering. I'll do what I can. I'm a, I I have to dip my tits in some ink first and sign some things. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> so, well, I would like I would totally like to watch that because that sounds killer. But I have to go I'm talk. Sorry, I didn't. I, you, know, you are just the most wonderful little pervert that <laughs> pretty vanilla could ever ask for. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty great. <laughs> you know. Okay, I. I'm gonna I'm gonna straighten this out. I gotta do it for the company. I'm gonna straighten out this ABCA compliance, and I need to look into whatever your stepdad's doing. And then you, Mister, you are gonna get front row seats to some printer ink tit drops. <laughs> Killer. <laughs> All right. Hey, speaking of that screen in my stepdad's office, uh huh. Um, when you were on there, you were like fucking that Greg guy. Oh, that's what that screen is. Do you know? Okay. Do you okay. know where that dude's at? Because I need to talk to him before I leave. You know, I've been trying to avoid him for most of the day. If I had to guess, I'd say that he was still down in the mail room. I have. Okay. Yeah. Is that like downstairs? Yeah, it's the. It's what was it? The triple basement? Is that the one? The triple sub basement? Uh, that's where he lived. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, then it's just the first basement. Yeah. Uh, Greg is going to wander out onto the. The balcony for his his smoke break. God. Sorry. <laughs> he's gonna he's gonna find himself on the balcony for his smoke break. Can the radio be on in the background? <laughs> oh god. Uh and, and Kyle's gonna find him out there. And it's gonna go splendid. Splendid. Oh, oh god. I need to touch those titties again. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do if I don't if I don't just rest my head on her bosom. If I don't do that soon, I'm gonna explode. Oh, what's up, Kyle? Hey, Greg. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Dude, I've been looking all over for you, man. I thought you'd be down in the mailroom, but you weren't down there. And then one of your buddies, Frank, that dude Frank, he's pretty cool, right? He told me you lived down in the boiler room in the triple sub basement, so I went all the fucking way down there. Oh, sorry, dude. There's, like, not an elevator down there. Dude, I dig that fucking Bob Marley poster you got in there. That's you like badass. That? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's cool. So, anyway, listen, I got to talk to you, man, because I... Dude, what's up? Anything? My... my Fucking stepdad, right? He was watching you fuck that pretty girl. Oh shit! Did he office. saw that. Oh yeah, god! He was I like, forgot he watches like everything I do. Yeah, he was jerking it to you, fucking her, and her titties were bouncing and stuff. <laughs> oh, dude, I will never forget the way they would they would float seamlessly up and then down. It poked me in the eye a few times. Sure, I mean, <laughs> how could they not? <laughs> I mean, no matter what the position, like, you're going to get There's titty no in the way. eyeball. Yeah. It's just going to happen. But anyway, so I blackmailed him, right? Because I told him I was going to tell I was gonna tell my mom. <coughs> yeah? Yeah, and so I got... Dude, that's so righteous. I know, right? So, so righteous. But here's the thing, like, if he doesn't get his paycheck, like... Oh. I'm not going to get the money he said he was going to give me. So do you have his paycheck? Oh. It's got to get to You didn't piss on it, did you? Oh, no, dude, no. Okay, oh. God. Shit. What? I'm just trying to remember because I don't, I don't know if I... Because you know how you said don't give him any of his mail? I know, I said that, but then... And I, I also like to... 
uh, give people the wrong mail. Right. <laughs> you know how I do that sometimes? Yeah, yeah. It's totally uh, cool. It's totally cool. Dude, I think I gave it to somebody else. Who did I give it to? Oh, oh God. I'm such an idiot. Oh. <laughs> oh, God. Who did I give it to? Oh, dude, did I give it to Pretty? I gave it to Pretty when I was talking here, talking to her. Oh, dude. Dude, I think I love her. I think I love Pretty. Dude, that's totally cool because she's like going, she's going to the gathering with us, dude. Dude, is she really? Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, dude, I got your pot, remember? Oh, well, I was thinking about that and then like. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I'm going to the gathering, right? Right. So I want to really, like, do it right. So Oh, I, so you want some ecstasy? Well, I heard you could get, like, anything there, like, on uh. that bridge or whatever. <laughs> I heard you could get, like, anything. Dude, so I heard I'm that, thinking, too. I've never been, but... I'm thinking that um, <laughs> instead what? of smoking pot right now, I'm going to wait till I get there and then... I'm going to walk across the drug bridge and then like <laughs> whatever anybody offers me, I'm just going to do it like right then. Dude, that sounds like such a journey. Yeah. <laughs> I'll, like I'll, te- I'll keep my temple pure until then. Yeah. Dude. <laughs> then All right. oh, dude, that, no, dude, that makes sense. It totally makes sense. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that way I'll get super fucked right. up. Anyway. Yeah, I love pretty. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Dude, you're like I want to be Mr. Vanilla. You're like a scratch. You're like a scratch CD, dude. <laughs> I know, but <laughs> just I can't stop thinking about her. You know, it's just like if I don't like, I just kind of like want to hang out with her and like smoke whatever and like talk about whatever, you know, or whatever. <laughs> Yeah, totally. I'm like whatever, dude. I totally yeah, get it. Yeah. <laughs> so just totally do whatever. Right. I, totally, dude. That's awesome. Totally. That's so fucking romantic, dude. I know, right? Dude, can I tell Should you I something? Should I write poems? Can I tell you something? Well, what's up? Dude, anything. Any or whatever. After the gathering. Assuming I don't die of some kind of overdose. <laughs> For sure. I'm, For I'm gonna, sure. I'm gonna take my stepdad's car and I'm gonna drive it to Vegas. Yeah, dude? Yeah, I'm gonna be a dancer, dude. Oh, dude, that's awesome. I know. Dude, I totally wanted to be a dancer one, but I had like these weird knees or whatever. <laughs> Isn't that guy's knees weird? Look at that guy's knees. That's a little gay. Oh, I God, think. I'm so self conscious about him. Stop. Uh. Gay knees. <laughs> <laughs> They're not gay, they're just they're, like weird. <laughs> Dude, I totally get it. I totally get it. It's cool, man. Anyway, so I picked up bass, and now I like. I'm really into reggae, right? Like or whatever. You're into like, like what? Like roots? Like yeah, anything that goes. You know, how like that that bass rhythm is? That's oh, all I know yeah. how to play. Right. So I just figured. Let's do that over do, and over. Do that. That's all you gotta do. Yeah. All right. Well, fuck. I guess I gotta go talk to Pretty again and get a check. Oh yeah, so, dude, totally. Hey, oh, yeah, dude. Um, do you want to go to the gathering with us? Oh, dude, I thought you'd never ask. I was like, oh, cool, the gathering. Oh, I wish I. Could. Well, I think I think Jarrett's got four tickets, and if I'm reading that guy right, he doesn't have like any friends. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't think he'd mind. Yeah, dude, he gets like no mail. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, so Kyle um, obviously has to go find Pretty to get his stepdad's paycheck so that he can get his money and they can leave for the gathering. Um, but she is off trying to find out what's going on with the ABCA Section 100 compliance report. Um, so she is not at her desk. Hey, um, like, excuse me, dude. Dude. Uh, 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 hi. You know that girl at the desk next to you? I, oh, God, yeah. I stare at that ass all day. Oh, she, oh, oh, I never looked at her ass. I know she's got killer tits, though. Do you know oh, where I'm she is? I'm not much of a chit guy. 
That's fucked up. Are you gay or something? I, I, um, that's a little gay, I think. No, I just... Girls have, like, nice butts. <laughs> okay, that's cool. Uh, anyway, do you know where she went? Because I really need to find her, like, really fast. No, but I wish I knew where she went. Sometimes I follow her. I didn't today because I, I had to... Uh, I need to get my compliances in order. Are you Are you crying right now? Yes. <laughs> okay, well... If you don't know where she is, then I, I don't want to talk to you anymore. I hate my job. I, I totally get I it, dude. I hate my job. I, to, I totally get it. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Hey, you, over there. Hey. Oh, uh, yes, sir. Hey, you know that girl that sits across over there in that cubicle right there? The with, one with the fine-ass titties? That, yeah, she's got some killer tits, dude. Yeah, I know her. Do you know where she went? I, I swear by my name, knee brace Carlos Van Sant, that <laughs> I have not seen that woman for at least the last 12 minutes. Your first name is knee brace? No, it's my nickname, son. Oh. Take a look at the gams. Have you seen them? Ooh. Knee brace Carlos Van Sant. Oh, my You God. know the name. Your legs look like hourglasses. <laughs> They're so thin in the middle. That's ridiculous. Ridiculous. <laughs> I have been training for years to get these here knee brace knees. I started knee binding when I was two years old. <laughs> it's an ancient samurai tradition. Oh, I heard of them. Yeah. That's why they call me Carlos Knee Brace or Knee Brace Carlos Van Sant. All right. Well, did you see which way she went 12 no, minutes have ago? Have you seen my knee brace trophies? <laughs> yeah, I don't really have time right now. Car- knee brace Carlos, whatever. I got a knee gotta, brace Carlos Van Sant, Mr. boy. Mr. Van Sant. I got it. She, she went to the right. To the right. Okay. All right. Not my right, not, oh. not yours. Oh, sorry. Thank sorry. you. Sorry. All right. It's the knee brace. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Did you- <laughs> <laughs> Do you know that that girl, uh, pretty vanilla? Oh yes, the one with the boobs. Yeah, right. She's got killer tits. Yeah. She, did she come by here like recently? No. But today might be opposite day. Oh, so God. what? <laughs> oh God. <laughs> what a bastard character. Who's your boss? <laughs> I don't know. I may be my own boss. Probably. Do you work here? That desk doesn't look like any of the other desks at all. No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> Just nobody noticed? or She went that way. You're pointing in both directions right now. That is not helpful to me at all. Or did she go this way? Oh, God. <laughs> or she went up or down, left or right. Hey. Hey, uh, 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 excuse yeah. me. D- did you did you say you're looking for pretty? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, totally, dude. I know where she went. Where where'd she go? Where'd well, she you go? have to do something for me. I don't listen. To I don't. The man. I don't know if I have time for a side quest right now. No, it's not. It's nothing. <laughs> okay. Well, what? 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 I gotta find her. Will you scratch my back? <laughs> <laughs> you use my scratcher. <laughs> What is this? Whale bone? Ivory. <laughs> uh, I got it right. in New Orleans. Okay, how long do I have to scratch your back? Because it's kind of gay. A, just for a moment. Okay. All right. Uh, that's it. That's it. Anyway, she's uh, she she's in the women's bathroom. Oh, awesome! Taking All a right. poop. Please don't talk to me anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, hey, you, where's the, where, which, where, where's the women's bathroom? Hey, you know, I, I'm just maintenance, eh? Why, why, you, why you come to Phil and ask him a question like that, huh? Why nobody, you come to Phil and uh, ask him a question like that? Nobody goes to Phil and ask him a question. Uh-uh, no. Nobody, you, I'm so, not I, in my house. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I just... I, I oh, mean, my God, Phil, calm down. Honey, honey, <laughs> gotta be the man. I gotta be the man around here. Ugh, who smells Daddy? like Dorito dust in Paul Malls? <laughs> Daddy... <laughs> You know, da- Phil, Daddy. I, I ain't taking too kind of this disrespect right now, honey. Da- daddy, what, Phil, what, Daddy. What do you need, Sam? Listen, listen to little need? Howie. I don't want to go little home. Little Sam Howie. I want to go home. Little Sam Howie. You want to go home? No? I want to go home. You want to go home? I want to go home. You need to learn the business 
of the maintenance. I'm, I'm sorry, Dad. And how are you gonna do that when you're at home? Don't hit me. <laughs> when I'm over, when I'm over committing domestic violence, I'm, you ain't gonna learn about maintenance at home because that's where you're gonna learn about terrible social habits. There's a camera <laughs> watching me poop. <laughs> He's, he's not there, wrong about that. It's there, it is there for a good reason. Excuse me? Uh, yeah, what, what do you need? It's bring your child to work day. I'm aware. Yeah, I know. But I lost my parents. Hey, Sam, you want a brother? Hey, oh. can we could be better. Do you like Yu-Gi-Oh, too? Yeah. <laughs> oh my What's God. your favorite card? I uh, Blue eyes. Oh, my favorite's the red eyes, black dragon. He's oh. not as good as the blue eyes. Uh, kid, what's but, your name? Uh, kid. Oh, <laughs> uh, my name? Yes. Yeah. Sebastian. All right, Sebastian. <laughs> you are now part of the Howies. That name sounds like You really are part of the Howies. Oh, uh, okay. Yep, that that's how this okay. works. You got, a, you, got a, you got a new brother. Uh, You're going to thank your dad? Why You're is he your black? <laughs> which which <laughs> way is the... Women's oh, I just room. walked by yeah, yeah, it. It's yeah, yeah. down the hall to it, the left. I, I suggest you leave pretty soon. I'm about to commit some de- domestic violence on my son. Okay, yeah, no questions. problem. I'm, I'm gone, yo. Oh, fuck, there it is. <sighs> pretty. Hey, uh, uh, occupied. <laughs> yeah, pretty. Hey, it's Kyle, dude. Oh, oh, oh little per. Okay, yeah, a little perfect. Come on in, come in. <laughs> Kill oh. her. Awesome. I get to watch a girl poop. <laughs> <laughs> Shows. Uh, hey, uh, uh, pretty. Yeah, um, how are things? How are things, Kyle? <laughs> Ooh. God. That is so hot. <laughs> do, um, do all girls take all their clothes off when they poop? <laughs> well, it's... <laughs> I would normally be, you know, much more appropriately dressed, but this is a special case of, uh, let's call it the triple P. I am so scared to ask what that is. It's, it's, a, it's a P, a little bit of, a little bit, a little bit of P, a little bit of poo, and a little bit of period, all at the same time. Oh, that's cool. Um... <laughs> So anyway, listen. Um, <laughs> DNA sequencing. <laughs> yes, yes, it's me. It's it's pretty vanilla. Trust me. Sequencing complete. Maintenance. Trying to work on these toilets or these toilets aren't working. Sequencing complete. Poop created by Pretty Vanilla. Ah, thank you. Yeah, that toilet's gonna <laughs> artificially inseminate you if you don't get off of it. So I need to <laughs> fix that. As long as it's better than four inches, I'm okay with that. <laughs> okay, so anyway, pretty, listen, listen. Earlier, Greg gave you my stepdad's paycheck, either what? by mistake or on purpose or something. I don't know, but do you have it? Hold on, hold on one second. Yeah, go ahead and put your clothes on. Oh, oh don't worry, honey. I put it somewhere safe. Oh. Oh, there it is. Oh, my good. You're right. It is a paycheck. That is Greg's just been all over me, so I just kind of tossed it aside, tossed it inside. That has stained so many unnatural colors. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God it is still in the envelope. Can I? Uh, would you? Uh, would you take it out of the envelope and hand it to me, please? Kyle, you charge into the women's restroom. You invited me. Uh, th- Fair. You charged into the women's restroom okay. after I invited you. Yeah. It, I, and now you're making demands about how you get your no, envelope back? C- please, it smells really bad in here, and it's, that envelope is not helping. Can you just... Could, it's super important. Okay, fine. Just for the little pervert, fine. Okay. I had a Lysol wipe somewhere. Here, borrow <laughs> mine. <laughs> Okay. There. Oh, uh, oh, oh my God. I'm going to... Pe- Kyle? Kyle? Maintenance guy. Maintenance guy. Uh, let me use this air dryer first. We, we Let's see a- if this air dryer is not working. Nope. It's not working. We have a pass out teenager in the restroom. You need to stop with your, your fucking hair appliances and help me. Ah. Can I get a <laughs> Maintenance is security too? No, it's just a yeah. We're at budget cuts. 
Let's pass that to Over. So, yeah, I'll just get the wheelbarrow. Don't worry about it. He needs to be awake. I promise to show him my printer ink tit drops. Um, oh, God. Oh, a Q40? Q40. What's the Q40? I'm going to let you handle this, okay? Uh, did I hear a Q40? <laughs> oh, no. Somebody say Q40 over there. Uh, it sounded a little gay wanna, to me. I want to see some nipple drips. <laughs> Code nipple drips. <laughs> uh, so, Lyndon's going to be in his office. He calls up Greg to see if he has his uh, paycheck. And we'll see what how it goes from there. And it's a, uh, whatchamacallit, it's an establish. Have fun. And it's not going to go well. It's not going to go well. Stay tuned. It's going to be great. <laughs> knock, knock, knock. Hello? Yeah, come in. Oh, uh, what's up, Mr. Heathen Ride or whatever? It's a little gay, I think. Oh, God. Can you, can you go? Mr. Thank H. you, Secretary. Um, just Mr. head out of there. Oh, uh, what's up, Mr. H? So, um, I was trying to contact your uh, mailroom, and the speaker's kind of faulty. Oh, uh, yeah, sorry. We're, uh, maintenance has been running all over the place trying to fix toilets. So. Oh. Are you blaming, on this, are you blaming this on me again? Oh, sorry. Let me just close this door. Wow, you're covered in a lot of shit. I'm sorry. <laughs> man. God bless you, maintenance guy. Um, man, a lot of people are in my office today. So, um, and it's like, so. I'm here, too. Yeah, okay, thank you. <laughs> Beh- get behind the desk. Yes, sir. Okay, underneath the desk, in the trap door. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, should I be concerned about what I just saw? <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna men in black you when you when you get when you get done. But awesome. um, yeah, it's not really. Um, so I am uh, looking for a my paycheck, and oh, did you like not get your mail? Um. Well, see, usually I don't uh, mind it. So sorry. Well, we've been less... super swamped down there. So maybe it just hasn't come to you yet. Well, it's just. I mean, usually I don't really care if I get my mail, but just this one's kind of important. It's uh, a lot of money, more money than you make <laughs> in a year. But um, but yeah. So if you could find. Hey, wait a minute. What's your name? G- Gregio Gambaruni Gambarskuski? Uh, well, it, it's, Gam- it's Gregio uh, G- uh, Grubbs o- Odom. Grubbs Odom. Gre- Gregio, uh, can I call you Greg? Uh, yeah, that's. That, uh, <laughs> sure, whatever you want to call me, Mr. H. Or can whatever. I call you Drew? I like that name. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sure, Mr. H, whatever you So, Drew, um. It's so much easier to remember. It's my dog's name. Oh, yeah. uh, so, so, uh, so Drew, uh, can you, uh, do you know anything about the ABCA Section 100 Compliance Committee? I know that I'm compliant. <laughs> <laughs> That's an office joke because you get it because it's inside joke because we both work in the same office, right? <laughs> That's well, I, funny. I, I work under you, your office. You should be a comedy man, a funny, funny fellow. Oh, uh, no, I... I, I play bass. Really? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, it's just because I got these weird knees. <laughs> Is there any way that your bass playing could help out with the ABCA Section 100 compliance? Because right now, I'll take anything for that to get Well, I only that. know the one reggae line, so... Ah, I, I play, I play uh, the bongos. So, little thing about your boss... Dude, do you I wanna... mean, I'm not like in the suit all the time. Oh. I have some fun. <laughs> do you want to like jam sometime? Uh, I mean, right now, yeah. Well, not like <laughs> right now or whatever, because it's we're at work. Well, yeah. I mean, I don't really work at work. <laughs> Mostly, I just kind of point and hey, you over there. I don't really know where I'm sending them. Hopefully. Anyway, what were you saying about uh, um, So the do you compliance? know anything about the ABCA section? It smells really yeah, weird in here. Yeah, you asked me that. Oh, oh, yeah. oh God, sorry. No, I, sorry, sir. I smoked some pot, uh, uh, some cigarettes. Oh, yeah, you smell like my son. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't. He just says son. it's Axe Cologne. That's what Axe smells like? Cigarettes? They probably... Kyle runs by in the hallway. You're not my real dad. 
<laughs> yeah, fuck you too. I'm not done. I'm not having you right now. Um, uh, so, uh, yeah, can you help us out in any way in the ABCA Section 100 Compliance Committee? Because I mean, I just sort the my, mail. Well, I, um, I mean, I guess I could. I mean, you know how to read, right? Yeah. Just like fifth grade level, because that's yeah. what I'm at, and I, I mean, think so. I've been coasting. What's fifth grade? Uh, sometimes they uh like the last year of elementary school. Sometimes it's sixth grade, but I mean, for right now, for just Dude, the sake just of brevity. My mind. Man, it smells really strong in here. Oh God, I'm so is sorry. That, is that that cologne? Yeah, no, it's uh, yeah. So yeah, okay. My balls are against the wall right now. Uh, there's this guy, <laughs> uh, Kale, <laughs> Littlefoot. He's about to stab me like really hard if I don't get this section 100 done. So can you? Uh, do you know if okay. you can help us out in any way? I mean, I mean, I guess so. I have some glitter in this drawer that I could give you, throw your way, a little bonus holiday bonus. Glitter like the street drug? Uh, <laughs> I mean, someone gave it to me, and they said it was glitter, and I took their word. If it's not glitter, I mean, I would, yeah, yes. If yes. I can get high off it, I'll take it. Uh, that explains why my son wants a lot of glitter. I mean, not high, uh, shit. It's probably uh, the only reason why Kyle wants all that glitter. There's no other reason why I might need that. I need to learn more about my Did I say son. hi? I meant... Sorry, I was having a uh, thought bubble. Uh, make crafts with. I'm sorry? Make crafts with. Who's that? <laughs> no, like... <laughs> like glue and, and <laughs> popsicle sticks... <laughs> like crafts. Oh. Are you high? <laughs> Are you high? No. <laughs> Mailroom. <laughs> <It's so funny. laughs> anyway, yeah, I'll help you with your thing. Um, is there any way in you can? Hey, random question. I'm always paranoid about this. Uh, but does everyone like? Is everyone like out? For me, like they want to fuck me over or anything. Well, you're the That's man. A gay, I think you're the man, man. I mean, what is wrong with that? I mean, what's like, if I was gay, like, there's nothing wrong with that. Well, right? I, well no. Uh, well, we just had a guy in the mailroom come out. We're all super proud of him. <laughs> when, yeah. when like the work day's over, we're gonna I, go no, out to I a bar that. and have a coming out party. It's I watched super that. Rad. I watched his uh, come. Oh, who the hell could that possibly be? Hey, uh... <laughs> Wait till the doors are open. No, uh, this is too important. Mr. Heathenrod, <laughs> my name's Candid. I work down in the mailroom. <laughs> and uh, I'm just going door to door, and I'm just letting everybody know I am gay. And I, I've been living alive for the past 68 years, and I just wanted to let everybody know. Hey, uh, take I'm some a, glitter, man. Dude, oh, s- thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. I'm going to go to the next office. Bye. D- Candid, super proud of you, bro. I love you, Greg. Candid, love you. And live long and That's prosper. That's a little gay, I think. That's a little nerdy. You know what? There's nothing wrong with that over here in this office. This anyway, is a safe, uh, safe zone. Mr. H, I'm going to go uh, work on your compliance. Yeah, uh, I don't really know what it's about, but you probably know I'll because figure, you're in yeah, the field. There's something about fonts. It's, yeah, I, I've <laughs> been getting those letters written in uh, Times... New Roman, that's no. super boring. Yeah, so, yeah, we gotta we, we gotta are, get that up to a, uh, not quite a comic sense. When but. John integrated and Bill Packett created this building, <laughs> <laughs> they they didn't want they they wanted to be beyond the cusp and not use Times New Roman. That's what our fucking competition. That's why we're in last place. Anyway, I'm going to go yeah. work on the compliance. <laughs> you have a very... Um, yeah, I'm just going to walk average out. Dick. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, average dick. Sorry, sir, about that. Goodbye. Because <laughs> he had to jerk off to it. <laughs> Jareth and compatriots um, are establishing that we are in the car in Kyle's dad's stepfather's car um uh, not his dad's stepfather but that was me correcting myself right kyle's stepfather's car headed towards the gathering 
of Juggalos. And here we go. And it goes bad. I'm sorry. It goes bad. It goes bad. So guys, I'm, I'm really thrilled that we're all here together in this car. Yeah, this is going to be so fucking killer. Greg, dude. get your hand off of my leg. Oh, sorry. There's like not a lot of room back here or whatever. Hey, hey Greg, could you hey, hand thanks me? thanks for inviting me. It's yeah. my absolute pleasure. Could you hand me another strawberry Fago, please? Uh, absolutely. So... Oh, sweet. This is a good tune. It's All right. Some good tune. Turn that shit nice. up a little bit. It's pretty nice. All right. So um, we just, we got to stop by, um, we got to stop by my dad's bank. We got to stop by your dad's bank? Yeah, because uh, he didn't have time because he's doing something with that, uh, that Abacab, whatever. ABCA. Yeah, that. Oh, the ABCA Section 100 compliance? Yeah, that. Oh, yeah. God. I was supposed to do something. What what was that? Something about complicating oh, something. Oh, I'm so. Why did I get high at the office? Yeah, that's I told right, myself dude, I wasn't going to do that anymore. This, this is, is why we're going we back there, so dude. Nice. So we, yeah, I got him to sign the paycheck over to me. So we just got to go by the bank and so I can cash it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Nothing about that sounds like it's going to go wrong to me. No. Nah, yeah, good. we might as well. <laughs> yeah, I hope easy. my clown my clown face impresses the teller. Yeah. Uh yeah. Should be fine. Uh, are you guys putting on makeup too? Are you guys wearing war paint? Yep. You know it, Jerry. Well, I don't want to cover up my forehead tattoo. That's true. You you're gonna feature it though, right? Yeah. Okay. I mean, later. I gotta come up with a with a fucking killer design, you know. You, you don't have one. Not already? yet. Not yet. You I, haven't registered uh, your face paint with well, the I international did, I did, but Juggalo I want, directory. I want to do a new <laughs> one for the gathering because this is like super. You special. can't. I mean. Kyle, I'm gonna excuse this because you're young. You can't just change your face paint like it's, like it's like it's your shoes or your socks. I mean, okay. we don't change our socks face ever. Face paint is your identity. Man. It's your whole thing. Uh, oh, okay. I, I, I mean, I don't, I don't want to say you're being gauche right now, but you're kind of being gauche on the way to this gathering of juggalos. I hear somebody say gauche in that car. Is that a little gay? Is that a little gay? <laughs> That was really gay. I guess he was really gay. Some rude people on these streets, man. man. Everybody's got their two cents. Yeah. Okay, there's a bank. Oh, here, let me. All right, you just wait right here. I gotta run inside. You can call it there. You come back. Well, um, I guess I'm gonna, uh, you know, I'm gonna hit some of this peyote real quick. <laughs> <laughs> cool man. What do, what do we what do we do with this? I don't know how peyote works. I well uh <laughs> do, we, like do we smoke some. it? Do we eat it? I think the Native Americans used to just smoke it, dude. So like what do, do I just put it in the I've got cigarette a, lighter or I've what do I do? I've got a bong back here. Greg, what are you <laughs> Wow, where did that bong come from? Uh uh, my pocket. It's collapsible. It's collapsible <laughs> oh, I see bone. the telescoping neck now. Yeah. All right. Well, yeah. I'm just gonna load this load this fatty bowl up real quick, <laughs> full of peyote. Hey, you guys hate me. <laughs> I'm not fond of you. Oh, hate's a strong word though. <laughs> oh. It's just like. It's like a lot of negative vibes or whatever in the car, and I'm uh, just like, like I, I, I think I'm a nice enough guy, but sometimes I feel like maybe. Greg, hit this peyote, man. What you doing? Okay, I'm gonna. All right. I see my spirit animal shit. <laughs> You still on about those bad vibes, Greg? Because right now... Yeah, there's just like a lot of bad vibes in this car, no. and I want to just like clear the air. Juggalo, you just need to get on your vision quest, boy. What you doing? That's right. That's why I'm here. I'm here because uh, I need a bigger dick. That's oh why I'm at... Oh, my God, Kyle. You were gone gathering. for like six years. It smells like burning cactus in here or something. Um, uh, so, I guess... 
uh, <laughs> if you want to cash a check, you have to have like ID or something. Guys, uh, there's up? a bleached cow skull talking to me. No, that's me, oh, dude. Kill dude, it's Kyle. That's me, dude. Kill yourself. <laughs> Don't worry about I it, man. I am freaking out right now, guys. I'm going to just close my eyes. Greg, <laughs> if you close your eyes, you won't be able to... Oh, God. Uh, Greg. I'm just having, like, a bad, bad thing Greg. right now. I just need to... Greg, if you close your eyes... I'm you... Satan. <laughs> Greg, if you close your eyes, you won't be able to see the great sky marmot. I need you to keep your eyes open. Okay. Okay? Okay. So, anyway... Uh, like great sky marmot. I guess you have oh to have God. like an ID card or a driver's license or something to cash a check. That makes sense. I don't know. I've never been to the bank before. I'm only 12. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, shit, bitch. Use mine. <laughs> you think that'll work? I said, I don't, you said they needed an ID. I got one of them. Okay, let me have it. Wait, hit that, hit this, hit this peyote first. Oh, I can wait until I get to the drug oh, bridge, bro. Oh, spirit animal. All right, uh, all right, okay, all right, all right, all right, fine. I am a happy giraffe right now. Yeah. That is a really good hit. Yeah, the baby lungs. Look at the baby lungs that going. Is a, woo. That is a really good hit. <laughs> <laughs> Have to get off. <laughs> I have... What is real? Oh, God. Uh, there's, like, people talking to me in, like, my head. Okay, I'm going to go. Give me your idea. I'm going to go back yeah, in the bank. Here you go. Get it. Get it, fool. Okay. Get that money. Pretty Vanilla steps out of the car and runs into a stranger. It's going to go bad for her. Was that a gun I just heard? <laughs> hey, what's up, my pet? You want to be a real pretty girl for me? Oh, God. I'm Detective Bradley Trollback. <laughs> you know the name. No, no. You've heard it on the streets. It's a nice set of knockers you got there. Oh, my God, it's Detective Trollback. What can I do for you, Detective? Uh, nothing for the time being. You want some money? You want to go in this dark alley with me? I am not a hooker. I ain't saying you are. I'm just saying you is. Oh, shit. That's my boy Toodles. I don't have to take that from a little smurf like you. Listen up, bitch. <laughs> I'm listening. I got a I got a whole situation going on right now, and I know what you're doing. I know the game you're up to. And my boys back at the station know the game you're up to. Just a second. Wait a second. Is that peyote I smell? I don't know what you're talking about. Who got that bong with the peyote in it? That's a very particular smell. Bradley Trollbags knows it. <laughs> I. I don't know what you're talking about, okay? Here's the thing. I've been working vice for a while. Deep undercover. You catch me? <laughs> you know who I am. <laughs> you know who that is? Troll bags. Troll bags. You've said that three times now. Yes, I know who you are now. Do you know why they call me troll bags? Why they call me troll bag? <sighs> Please enlighten me. Because I'm good with a knife. He's good with a knife. <laughs> He's good with a knife. So listen to me now, you little pretty face. You want to keep your little pretty face. You're going you're gonna to go ahead and you're going to deliver those documents to us that you said you would about the ABCA Section 100 compliance. You're not going to do it, are you? That is confidential. That's within our company. I, I Bitch, listen over. to me before I cut your face off. He go cut you. Thank you, Toodles. So listen up. Here's the thing. You haven't delivered the paperwork in time. So I got to settle a score. So I'm going to cut you in the face. I'm going to need you to not run away for a second while I fetch my knife. Excuse me? Toodles, get my knife. I... 
Toodles, if you touch that knife, I swear to God, I will have a period all over you. Oh, God. <laughs> That's nasty. I want to be really far away this whole time. <laughs> so pretty. You remember, you remember what happened in St. Louis? <laughs> Tell me the story about St. Louis again before I cut your face off, pretty. You go and do it. Okay, Just fine, bag. troll bags. It was you <coughs> and me and a couple of guys, and you wanted me to show you the signature move. So I went ahead and ate a lot of Taco Bell before, and it had about a gallon's worth of water. And yes, it was the 14th of April. So yes. It was that time of month. I gave you the triple P. You want me to tell you again? I gave you and the guys a triple P. Whatever. Is it in the glove compartment? I don't see it. No, it's in the trunk. Toodles, Toodles, you dumb bastard. Toodles, you dumb bastard. You touch that knife and I will period all over you. Pretty That's shut. Why I'm over here. Pretty. God. I love you. You're the only you're the only triple P I ever met in my life. I get good money for that triple P. Toodles, toodles, it's in the spare tire area. You get it out of the spare tire Is area. Is it like a lever or something? No, it's just you lift the thing, the carpet. You move the carpet. Good help is hard to find, I guess, <sighs> isn't it, troll bags? Found it. Now I'm going to toss it at you. Our I mothers are friends. She scares me. That's what I'm saying, all the way over here. Just give me the fucking knife already, toodles. I'm going to slide it on the floor at you. All right. <laughs> Thank you, Toodles. You can go get a cupcake now. You got it? All right, pretty. I'm going to need you to lean forward about like six inches. <laughs> six inches? Honey, that's only going to reach the tip of my areola. <laughs> Sa! I just cut you in the face. Oh, God, my nose. Troll bags, you know the name. I'm out. Deuces. Deuces. <sighs> Don't mess with the vice squad again. God. You give me my, you give me my paperwork. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, Toodles, why are you using a typewriter right now? I don't understand. <laughs> Toodles, I know I strap it to your belt, but there's no reports to type right now. What are you doing, Toodles? I'm trying to start the car, but... I'm... Toodles, you can't start a car with a typewriter? <laughs> what are you doing? Is that guy trying to start a car with a typewriter? I don't know. It's a little gay, I think. It's a maroon. <laughs> what a macaroon. Toodles, put the knife back in the trunk. How's your nose? Does it hurt? It'll get better, but Jesus. Fuck it, Will. Slash! Oh, God! My other no- side of my nose. <laughs> yeah, I cut both nose. sides. I evened you out. I'm done with this now. I'm a. I, Toodles, why have you not taken this knife? Toodles, get off the typewriter. <laughs> Take the knife. David's broken. I'm out. <laughs> Throw it on the ground and kick it to me. I'm not going next to her. Troll bags, out. God. Bra, 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 bra. <laughs> I got to cover this up with some <laughs> clown makeup. <laughs> uh, Greg, um, this is a flashback to when Greg is in... Uh, he just left Lyndon's office, and he's trying to figure out the uh, how to how to help with the ABCA Section One Hundred compliance. Um, and he obviously has no idea what he's doing, and he's down in the boiler room with the other boiler rats, as we call ourselves. And this is going to go um, well. <laughs> For some reason. For some reason, it's going to go splendidly. Okay, uh. Hey, what's up, guys? Hey, how's it going, Oi. Greg? How's Oi. it going? Hey, Oi, what's, what's up, up hey, mate? Hey, Hello. How, how are you, Greg? No, guys, I've got, like, this problem. Really? Yeah, what's up? What's up? Uh, so, um. So I was up there, and Mr. H was like. You were on the surface? Yeah. What's it like? Uh. It's normal. Oh. It's whatever. It's, like, brighter. Oh, not, 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 not fan. Not yeah, fan. I wouldn't like that, man. Anyway, guys, like, he wanted right. me to help out with some, like, complications or whatever, so with some abacas or, or... Alpacas. Alpacas. Yeah, maybe that was it. Maybe I was supposed to complicate right, some alpacas. Man. You're to make, alpaca. You okay. make him a sweater, okay. right? Oh, dude, maybe he wants me to make him a sweater or yeah, whatever. Oh, Guile. 
Alpacas make great sweaters, man. Dude, they totally do. Oh, dude, where That's am I going to get in an alpaca? I got one, man. Dude, you got an alpaca? We keep, we keep oh, them down no, here. We keep, no. Oh, no. That's a wrong. I'm an alpaca. <laughs> oh, dude, I am so oh, high yeah. right now. There's an alpaca talking to me, guys. <laughs> you guys see him? I forgot you were an alpaca, man. Alpaca. Yeah. No, I Let's thought you were Algerian. Oh. I don't know. Can we kill oh, him? I think he's a fucking cut. Oh, Sorry, dude, that was, down, that was unnecessary. Dude, I. <laughs> anyway, I can't. I can't kill the Algerian and make a sweater out of him. That's like weird, or whatever. Yeah, that is pretty weird. Oi. Oh, weird for surface people. Not so weird for us. <laughs> <laughs> Your mole's the best. Your mole wins. <laughs> Oi. Hey guys, Oi. I just like. Like he's like trusting me or whatever with this like big thing, and I like I'm not, I think I'm gonna let him down. He's maybe into you. He might he's, be into you. Oh, dude, yeah, you think he he's gay be. for me? He might be, man. Yeah, yeah he gay. might be. I think he's a fucking cunt. Maybe. Well, yeah, dude, sit right. Down. Yeah. Can you sit down? Right. Maybe I should oh. hook him up with Candid. You think he? Maybe that's what he wanted me to do. <laughs> Greg, I'm 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 getting worried about you. I, uh, you you you're you're growing distant from. A subterranean. <laughs> well, I gotta go out there and like give the the uh, the terrarian uh, their mail. The surface dwellers. The surface dwellers their mail. Yeah, man, the surface dwellers. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I gotta give them their mail, or they get like super like mad at me and. I'm... Bummer, man. That sounds like surface problem. What what need mail down here for? Well, it's just like that. They pay for me to live down here, so I gotta give them their mail, so they let me live with like with you. They guys. pay me in peanuts. Blah! I can cover your shifts for you as long as they are at the night. Ah 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 ah! Yeah, man, like Vlad can totally cover your night shift. Oh, thanks, Vlad. <laughs> I I I would appreciate it if you would use my honorific, Doctor Vlad Acula. Ah. Oh, oh. Yeah, yes. doctor can cover it, doctor, man. Doctor, he could, he could do the thing. I so forgot what, what it was. What, what were you supposed to do? You for need help this with dude, ABC, man? A. Oh shit! Yeah, I was supposed ABC. to like make sure everything's A B C A section one hundred oh, compliant. Oh, dude, I can help with that. I wrote the manual, man. <laughs> oh, dude, no way. Yeah, I totally wrote the manual, man. He Tell you what. It. I'll Wait. just I'll rewrite that thing, man. This is Bill integrated. Yeah, man. You didn't know that, dude. You're like one of the company founders yeah, or whatever. Yeah, oh, totally. Whoa. Totally. I'm John Packett. I'm John Packett. Oh, he oh. John Packett. Yeah, John. No, Packett, he's John man. Packett. Who's oh. the real? I John Packett. It's him. Everybody's John <laughs> Packett, man. <laughs> His like name, Spartacus. Oh, oh, oh. His name is John Packett. Oh, but no, seriously, dude, that's my mind is just John blown Packett. wide open. <laughs> Yeah, man. So tell you what, man. Like, I totally wrote the ABCA section 100 manual, and like, then I like got burnout, and I moved down here to the boiler room, and so like, I'll go rewrite the manual, and like, everything will be fine, man. Dude, that'll be super awesome. Yeah, don't worry, man. Oh, thank you. So Kyle, uh, establishing a scene, is going to head back into the bank with. Jareth's ID uh, to try and cash his stepfather's paycheck. So we have three <laughs> three last names in play here, but somehow this is going to go well for me. Nice. <laughs> and of course, he just smoked a bunch of pay- huge hit of peyote out of the bong. <laughs> that twelve year old bong. <laughs> yeah, and he's twelve. <laughs> he's standing in line at the bank. <laughs> Next. Uh, hey. Next. Yeah, that's, uh, hey. Down Why here. are you so far away? Come closer. Uh, it looks like you're like four inches from my head right now. How old are you? It's a little gay, isn't it? Um, <laughs> <laughs> hey, shut up, lady. Uh, yeah, um... Here's my ID. How can LaFonda help you? Um, it, here's my ID. 
And mm-hmm. he, here's here is my paycheck mm-hmm. side to me on the back, and I would like to have the money, please. <laughs> this is a lot of money. Yeah. Where'd a little tyke like you get so much money? Well, um, I, I, I'm in charge of uh, I'm in charge of uh, the the ERD team for Integrated Alpaca Logistics. LMC. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna stamp this. Why are you far away again? Oh, uh, it's really loud over there, man. It's really loud. <laughs> Little game, isn't it? Do you hear that? What? Did, <laughs> that. That. Did you hear that? What are you talking about? Oh God, where did that other nose come from? Other nose, child. (laughs) You tripping? Nothing is real. Everything in the world is fake. Child, you tripping right now? Could we just get the money, please? God, fine. La Fonda got your money right here. (laughs) Thank you, La Fonda. What flavor are these suckers? It's uh, it's the dum dum variety. Do you have any root beer? I think somewhere in the bottom. Okay. Your face is Next. melting off. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take a root beer and... Uh, I have to go. Oh, oh my God. Next. Wait, where's the path through the brambles the to get to the door? The Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, thank you for your assist. Oh, can I have my ID back? Oh, my God. Um, so Lyndon Heathenrod, remember him? He's gonna go upstairs to the uh, <laughs> Kale, Littlefoot, and Pete, and they're gonna have a talking because he couldn't find the ABCA Section 100 papers because everyone got high and left the office <laughs> to go to. The Gathering, which happens to be that day. Crazy, right? So he's going to go talk to his supervisors, and his supervisor's not going to be too happy. But what? It's going to end good? Well, stay tuned and find out. (laughs) Carol. So anyway, I says to him, I says... You can't be a real polar bear. (laughs) Shut up. Kale finds polar bear attractive. Sorry, sorry. Yes. I, I understand that, Kale. I think. Regal. Yeah, uh, come on in. Door knock. <laughs> Kale, make a note to call Phil. We got to get that door fixed. Lyndon, how you doing, buddy? Hey! Hey! <laughs> 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 Lyndon, what's wrong, buddy? You know Relax. those uh, those Packers, right? I mean, they got boned in the in the the super. Uh, Lyndon, super Bowl, why right? you make face water? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Lyndon, calm down. Uh, it's baseball season. <coughs> Relax a little bit. Come on, buddy. Just ah, here, sit down. Sit down. Rockies. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. <gasps> Uh, <laughs> What's going on, Lyndon? You got the you got the ABCA Section 100 compliance report for us. That's Ching! my favorite Jackson Five song. Uh, ABCA one two three one hundred one 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 hundred section one hundred. Uh, almost, yeah, yeah, that's almost a thing, buddy. Uh, yeah. So um, I don't got it. I I was you, gonna come up with an excuse. I don't. You don't, I got, don't it, got it, huh? No. You don't got no. it. Well, oh, is it buddy, hot I, in here? I am, I am so sorry I'm to hear that. I'm gonna take off my 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 hen tie real quick. Yeah, you, you like might want to go ahead and take off your jacket and roll Ooh. up your sleeves too, because uh, oh god, we're I'm dueling. Gonna, uh, I'm gonna reach into my vest pocket here. No. Yep, yep. I sure am, buddy. It's this is gonna be just just don't worry about it. You're gonna be fine. I'm just gonna hand. Why this do those to, two uh, secretaries have guns? Uh, they're just, <laughs> they're just back up. <laughs> Shut up. There's there just back is. up, and uh, <laughs> I'm just going to hand this note to uh, to Kale here. And Kale, why don't you read that note? 
in English or native Native language. Native tongue, of course. Let's keep the mystery for just a second longer. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Hey, Kale. Uh, here's the steak. I found it. It's not a steak. It's, it's just my phone. Kale, read now. Go right ahead, Kale. Listen to this. You're going to love this, Lyndon. Hey, Kale, I like your beard. Oh, man. <laughs> Nervur kur kongkash namavach shil kurva. Emma, el okorsh tadarapakarasan. Only senior executive in the entire company that speaks draconic. Nice. What happened to all the windows? They're broken. Yep, don't worry about that. But you might want to watch out for Kale. He's coming at you with that metal shiv. <laughs> Get him, Kale. Kill him. I will kill him now. Get him, Kale. Come on now. There you go. There's an opening right there. Right there. Right there, right there. <laughs> right there in his neck. <laughs> Oops. Kale! No! What happened? <laughs> this is CK and the Fart explaining what just happened. So, let's see what happened. Lyndon, he was just about to get stabbed with a, uh, what would you call that? Well, uh, Fart, I'd call it a metal ship made from a hanging file folder rod. Whoa, that's intense. So, yeah, WXQR2. So then all this action music came on. And, right? Yeah. Yeah. What happened that was there? something. So, like, Lyndon started rolling around on the ground, and uh, Kale just started stabbing right at him, and he right? kept on missing. Yeah, I kept yes. on missing. Stab Weirdo. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> WXQR2. Fart. <laughs> so, then, then what happened next after uh, he missed him and stabbed the ground? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, you tell, uh, okay, I'll tell you what happened. Well, it was, it was kind of hard to tell. I mean, it just got blurry. You know, there was a lot of blood. There was metal flashing around. The two assistants... Yeah, a lot of blood. That's right. Flashing is the $100 cash word today. (laughs) (laughs) Flashing. All right, girls. All right, caller number six. You win $100 right now because we said flashing. Call it. Anyway, so we had the metal, you know, and you know what? When the dust settled for it. Oh, my God. Then... Everyone, the assistants, yep. Pete, yep. fucking Kale. That's right. Kale is name. We yep. got Kale here. Surprise guest. <laughs> yeah, you tell, tell, tell us what happened when the dust settled, Kale. <laughs> <laughs> what up in 619? <laughs> Hey, the 619. 619. That yeah. is the today's $200 cash area code. Caller number 7 from the 619. You won $200. Carol is bleeding heavily now. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, is that because you stabbed yourself? Fell fell on file folder. Fell on, your fell on file folder. Fell on your ship. All right. Yeah. Um, Hot stuff. Going to die now. Okay, Kale. Whoa. Well, thanks for stopping by the studio, buddy. Hey, Don't so. forget to pick up your T-shirt and your bumper sticker on the way out. Hey, well, do you want to flash those tits for us? Yeah, show us some tits, Kale. Come on. Kale has one final word. Big, big up to big up to my homies. Family. Family indeed, family. Kale. Family I'm indeed. I'm dumping one for my homies. There that you can, go. Yeah, homies. dump one. Only, dump, only, only dump one. There you go. Dump. It for my homies. Homies. <laughs> All right, so Kale's dead. So it looked like Lyndon just kind of... He peed got... all over himself. Oh, of course he did. Wouldn't you expect anything less? And then what What did Pete do after all that? Um, oh, Pete, he jumped out the window for fear of his life. Yeah, because, yep. I mean, when you see someone kill themselves, you want to kill yourself. That's right. Scientific study. Balls, balls, balls. All right, okay. so um, Jareth 
has gotten one white, oh, which is dreadful. Yeah. You are certainly dead. <laughs> probably from a self-inflicted wound. People you care about are also probably dead. Maybe through your own stupid, ugly failure. To say that you <laughs> fucked up is an insult to fucked up upness. <laughs> you have redefined the term. Pretty Vanilla got 15 black. Uh, black 13 plus is awesome. Insanely great. You will emerge not only unscathed, but if there's a girl involved, she's dropping her drawers. <laughs> you might even get rich off this caper. Who knows? Time for a new ride. Okay, Greg got 10 white, which is not too shabby. You've made it out with dignity intact through some fluke. There might even be a little profit or self-respect or whatever. Time to throw a little party for all your friends. So, like, <clears throat> Kyle Dermott got, like, two white, which is merciless or whatever. <laughs> you might not be dead on the outside, but you sure as hell are dead on the inside. Oh, that's perfect. The emotional or mental wounds you have suffered will never heal. And the future is like a brick wall or whatever. <laughs> Nothing to write home about. Back where you started, maybe sore and broke, but just like yesterday and tomorrow, you'll probably learn something, though. Like how to do it right next time. Oh, yeah, that's really next time. Right. Love That's about perfect. So, uh, this is Jareth looking out the window of his car, seeing Pretty Vanilla getting her face cut by a very angry <laughs> man. Pretty Vanilla was upset at her recent nose modifications, but she wasn't going to let little people like Detective Trollbags hold her back. And she was going to flaunt her new facial features so all the world could see. Okay, uh, Greg um, is with the other boiler rats, and, and one of them, uh, and he, he wants to go on a journey to find a big dick, and one of them tells him about uh, a a monastery in Nepal <laughs> that, that knows the secret. <laughs> oh this is going so yeah, I like it. This is Kyle, like, walking out of the bank or whatever, and, like, <laughs> s- something happened while he was in there because, like, that's not the parking lot anymore. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> the ground looks like it's boiling, and, like, the trees look like fingers or something they're real weird and they're like pulsating um well this is linden and uh well (laughs) um it's not the first time i've seen someone die um (laughs) so i'm kind of desensitized to it um no i i I didn't kill anybody or anything it was it was a office a staple related accident um amen and so uh not too hardcore, just, uh, you know, shakes up the bones a little bit. This is Jareth confronting the mean man with the knife. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is Jareth with his entrails in his hands. <laughs> Pretty Vanilla went on tour. She approached every major TV station she could, and she found that her new nose slashes were a fashion hit, and everybody wanted to get some. Okay, Greg uh, uh, lands at an airport in Nepal, uh, and he gets off the plane, and he finds uh, an alpaca farmer. He finally, he finally figures out what an alpaca is. Uh, and, and the uh, alpaca farmer uh, knows the way to the, to the monastery. Up mountain. Where, uh, yep, where, the, uh, where the monks with the big dicks are. Up, up mountain for big dick. Mm. Uh, thanks. Uh, t- so like, Kyle's <laughs> just standing there outside the door to what used to be the bank. And it's like, Beautiful and terrifying, and he figures everything out like all at the same time. And he sits down on the sidewalk and starts to weep, cry. 
So uh, I kind of decided I'm just going to lay off watching porn at the office just until all this blows over. So uh, I had a lot of free time in my hands, so I finally researched what uh, ABCA uh, Section 100 means. Involved uh, uh, sexual harassment forms and the different ones there. And uh, yeah, I could see why we fucked up in that sector. <laughs> This is Jareth, um, <laughs> still holding my guts in my hands. Um, I fall down to the ground and my vision gets blurry. And I look up at my attacker and I think, oh gosh, he's good with a knife. They should call him troll bags. <laughs> they call him troll bags. Pretty Vanilla has made it. She is an American <laughs> mega star now. You thought Calvin Klein was hot? Uh-uh. You didn't know anything until Pretty Vanilla hit the scene. <laughs> okay. Greg uh, has reached a monastery on top of a mountain in the, in the Himalayas. On mountain in Himalaya. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, and he, he meets with uh, a band of monks, of mountain monks, and he he begins to pray, and they give him a potion, which he he which he drinks in a meditative stance. <laughs> when when something begins to arise in, in his pants. That's fucking brilliant. So, I guess the peyote's <laughs> starting to wear off now. Cause uh. Just looks like a parking lot now. <laughs> and uh, I don't rem- remember what, what my name is. But that guy with the knife looks nice. <laughs> I'm going to go talk to him. So uh, um, I had a lot of extra time in my hands. I... Uh, Hopefully, you know, I want to work on a, a business uh, partnerships, uh, be more of an active boss, not a boss that just kind of sneaks out at two. <laughs> As an office joke, we always say, like, sneaking out at two. Never mind. That's a little gay, isn't it? Uh, fuck, <laughs> fuck off, okay? You're fired. I'm just going to fire this. That's, that's a pink slip right there when you call anyone gay. And yeah, here's like eight of them for you. I'm just, uh, mm-hmm. What a fool. This is Detective Bradley Trollbags. I got a new sidekick on the streets. I send him out to pimp out my drugs, to pimp out my women's, to pimp out his booty, whatever, whatever I need pimped out. He doesn't know his name. It's fine. I just call him stupid. I don't know my name. No, it's not you, Toodles. (laughs) Shut up and get back in the car. (laughs) I, I... Toodles, shut the fuck up! I seem to recall that this is my fucking moment <laughs> in the aftermath. Anyway, sorry about that, dear diary. <laughs> I, got, I got some real loud mouths around me. I'm in a dear diary. I'm really glad that I have Dummy in my life now. I call him Dummy sometimes, too. He's, he's, he's 12 years old. He wears a trench coat. <laughs> and, uh... And he really likes to pay Odie. That's all, dear diary. Signing off. Love your truest friend, Detective Bradley Trollbags, MD. This is a momentous occasion for <laughs> mankind, not just pretty vanilla. She is the first United Nations elected <coughs> fashion expert of the world. <laughs> People from all sorts of countries have now flocked to her asking for advice on how they can promote their products. And she is only too happy to help. Two years later, <laughs> Greg has forgotten everything about his previous life working for the man. Uh, he has reached enlightenment uh, and has one of the biggest dicks in the world. <laughs> he... Uh, he likes to celebrate with his, with his mountain monk brethren. He parties all the time. And now he is the lead 
bassist for their <laughs> band. <laughs> so, um, quiet. The office's been pretty uh, quiet lately. Uh, Jareth hasn't showed up for a while, but I'm not that kind of boss who fires people. People need to take personal days. Um, same thing with Pretty Vanilla. I don't want to fire those tits. I mean, I'm gonna fire her. So, uh, yeah, she hasn't shown up for a while either. And uh, Drew, Greg, Greg, Drew, he hasn't shown up either. But uh, yeah, it's been uh, just pretty much just the normal weirdos here. And yeah. What's a uh, five-letter word for uh, lightning? <laughs> lightning. Pretty Vanilla had it all. She achieved what no woman had done before, becoming a UN elected fashion expert, and <laughs> she felt that she needed, she needed one last thing, one last <laughs> wrong to right. But she needed to relax first. She found her way to a, a monk reggae band somewhere. They're performing at the Denver Center, I think. <laughs> and on stage, she saw someone familiar. She saw Greg, back from her days at Integrated Packets Logistics LLC. <laughs> and she talked with him after the concert, and he was way different now. It, it, it was really cool. And I got to tell you, I've never had such a good 12 inches. <laughs> All right. I'm Jonathan Margheim. I'm Lewis Char. I'm Trey Burns. I'm Bob Morsh. I'm David Atkinson. And that's the Tilt, a fiasco podcast. See you next week. Well, boys and girls, that's our story for this week. We hope you enjoyed listening to it as much as we enjoyed making it for you. If you enjoyed this game and would like to play your own game of Fiasco, why not head over to BullyPulpitGames.com and learn more about it? Or head to your local game shop and buy your own copy of the rulebook. You can follow this show on Twitter at Tilt Podcast or on our Facebook page. If you'd like to send us an email, you can do that to the address TiltPod at gmail.com. The Tilt, a fiasco podcast, is a Dr. Bob Media production. Thanks for listening, and we'll see you next Wednesday. <laughs>